Yo, 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 welcome back to the channel. So today, I'm gonna talk to you guys about this. So today, I'm gonna talk to you guys about this. A really cool camera accessory bag that I just picked up, plus what I put inside it. So this is an accessory bag that's basically made for your action cameras, your GoPros, uh, that sort of deal. Any small type of cameras that you're gonna carry around. What I love about it most is that it has a padded compartment with internal dividers that you can actually take out and size up to your camera. Let's talk about what cameras I actually put into those padded little pouches there. So the first camera I have is my Sony action camera, the original, which is an HDR AS15. I'll put a link in the description below if I can find one for it, but it's pretty old. So I still love the video that this thing takes. It takes great video. It has a little bit of a larger battery. It also has uh, quite a few inputs and outputs on it uh, versus the newer ones. Uh, the downside is, is that the case isn't waterproof itself without it being inside the designated waterproof case. So that is my first action camera, is an HDR AS15 Sony. Love it, still use it. A lot of my videos that you've seen with this camera would have been with the headband attachment, which I carry inside the case, and that's actually where that camera is attached at all times to the headband. And that fits nicely in the case with the divider. The other camera that I carry in the case at all times is my second Sony camera, is an HDR AZ-1. This camera is actually splash proof without a cover. I will use it out in the elements a lot more than my older Sony camera. A great little camera, a lot smaller than the original one that I have, and again, it takes wonderful video. That's what's in my camera bag in the form of cameras is the Sony HDR AZ-1, my newest camera, and the Sony HDR AS-15 is my older camera, as well as waterproof cases for both, and the wristband with GPS and LCD display, which to be honest, I use my phone most of the time. I don't use the wristband option, but it's nice to have a dedicated LCD screen when you know, you're shooting. If you don't have a phone around, you can use this dedicated LCD screen, which is really cool. And that came with the HDR AZ-1. It is also compatible with the HDR AS-15. Looking further into the bag, you can see that I have my GoPro adapters. So, link in the description of these below. If you do have a Sony cam or an Icon camera or uh, any other type of action cam besides GoPro, what you're gonna find is that most of the adapters out there are made for GoPro. You can get these cool little adapters here with your standard camera tripod adapter here and then a GoPro piece there. So those are carried in my bag as well as the proprietary Sony camera attachments, extra batteries, memory cards. I have my selfie stick inside here as well, Gorillapod, some Moment lenses, and that's about it. So that's what's inside my camera bag. So we have everything we need for a full day of shooting. So if you're looking for an excellent camera bag to store all of your gear, organized and protected, I definitely recommend the Cam Kits Action Camera Bag. I have put a link in the description below, so if you wanna grab one of those for yourself, just click that link, it's gonna take you to the Amazon page. Hit buy and away you go. It'll probably be delivered to your door in two days if you're a Prime member. Thanks for watching today. Make sure you smash that like button below. Hit that subscribe button and that little bell to be notified when I upload new videos. And we will see you in the next one. Take it easy out there. Everybody, thanks for watching today. Smash that like button to send us some love. Hit that subscribe button if you'd like to see more. And don't forget to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Hope your day was full of awesomeness.